Hi, so in my blog, you know, people have been asking, what are you eating lately? You're looking so healthy. Tell me, what's in your meal? Well, good for you. Uh, I thought I'd record my meal today, what I've made, what's healthy. And uh, it's pretty simple. You might just have this uh, laying around the house, make it for the kids, make it for the wife. You know, it's it's all good. So uh, this is fresh, you know, fresh out of the refrigerator. This is uh, my where I get all my, uh, great for my cholesterol, you know, so, uh, here's a look, you know, I like to prefer having this for dessert, it is, uh, I'm trying to show this, what you see here, a, uh, piece of lettuce, which is seen here, a nice pickle, uh, a side of ranch, popcorn, and, uh, yeah, that's my, my, uh, frozen food. And I did have an egg to the side, um, which I will be cracking. And, uh, you know, you won't get a sound malipsimolia from, from eating the raw egg. And actually, uh, if, if you, if you, uh, practice Buddhism, you know, it helps you meditate. You know, Gandhi, I don't know much about the man, but what I do know is he recommends, uh, an uncooked egg raw egg, you know, great for the meal. So, uh, you might be thinking, wow, you're crazy, you know, you're crazy, you're gonna eat, you're gonna eat that, that, uh, them freezer foods without, without your whole grain, without your bread? No, no, I've got the noggin up here, and I've got my two slices of bread. So, uh, here we go. I'm gonna show you how to, how to cook food. 101. Simple. Uh, a man can do it. Ha! <laughs> <sighs> okay. I'll put it over here so you can probably see. I've got my my whole whole wheat whole white bread here. I'm going to crack the egg on top of that. I can't do that. Okay, now here's what you should be at right now. Uh, step, step two. Here's my egg. You know, it's not fully on the, fully on the, uh, on the, the wheat, the white bread. And I got some eggshell on there. It's fine if you get some eggshell on there. I certainly kind of recommend it at times. Uh, it gives it the extra kick, the crunch. Um, so yeah, here we are. I'm gonna get the egg yolk. Go ahead and uh, kind of, you want to bat it. You want to bat it really good. So that's what I'm doing right now. I'm batting the egg. Um, and this is the really important step, you know. It uh, gets the, the nice flowy texture in there. And, uh, you know, when you, it doesn't look like much, but man, when you taste it, it gets there. So yeah. Then this is really important because this is on your whole wheat side. Uh, this is on your grains, you know, your daily grains. And when you have one meal a day like me, you want the grains to be extra, extra good. So, uh, here's the, the yolks on my bread, as you can see. Now, I have the dripping part off. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to just rub it against the other piece of bread. Go ahead and pat it there. All right, great. So, uh, it looks a little bit like mustard. So when I think mustard, you know what I want? is a little bit of ketchup. One packet's good, and I'd recommend it because it's healthier. So go ahead and open up that pack of ketchup. And uh, here's the fun part. You know, the kids can help out with this. Um, go ahead and uh, draw any design you want on your bread. Alright. Um, now I am making this for my, uh, I, uh, teach religious classes, so I'm making this for my religious class. Alright, almost done. Now, when you open up the ketchup packet, it's very important that you do it the right way because, uh, 
how I opened it. It's just coming out it kind of, you could, uh, this is not a PG-13 cooking show. You can uh, relate this to a prolapse. If you've been around the internet, you probably know what that is, a prolapse. So uh, you don't want the prolapse kind of catch up. You're going to try and open it up on the corner. Rather, when I just opened it up in the middle, uh, you kind of get the prolapse effect, which is a common thing in cooking. Amateurs do it all the time. Uh, you probably wouldn't expect it. So when it does come, you're going to freak out. You're going to say, how do I fix this? How do I fix this? Well, think, what would you do if you had a prolapse in real life? Actually, I don't know the answer to that. Alright, so I guess this won't be used for my religious classes since I really screwed this up. But I'm just going to smear this across the yolk. Um... Alright, now here's what the main piece of bread looks like. That's yolk with uh, some ketchup on top of that. And I will be eating this on camera. Alright, so now you have your frozen foods. Now it does look good in the uh, in here, but it tastes so much better once you actually get it onto the, onto the bread. So let's do that. I'm going to take the big piece of lettuce. I did uh, pour some nice chocolate on there. So I got my lettuce. And you know, you can just get that from a salad. I have uh, some pretty old salad from last year that I never ate. So I'm just using the leftovers. Uh, I like to, you know, vegan me, I like to, to reuse. So now I have this pickle. I'm going to cut it up into tiny pieces. So cut your pickle. Um, and right now I have the... Uh, I have the popcorn, the ranch, and the syrup. You're gonna go ahead and uh, mix mix that around in there. And that uh, looks like a nice ice cream. So when you do eat this, if you're grossed out for any reason, I don't know why you would be, but uh, just pretend you're eating an ice cream. And it does smell a little uh, taint, a little rough, a little uh, tittling, a tittling taint, if you may. And that's what it should look like. And just pour it on. Pour your pickle and popcorn onto the bread with the uh, the mixture we just made. And great. Now it's just time to uh, eat it. So, this will help you meditate in your in your deep cycles of Buddhism. So this is Buddhism Cooking 101, and it's the, the first thing you want when you're being a Buddhist in cooking. Uh, the egg yolks, uh, when you meditate, it gets the chemical imbalances in your brain, and uh, it sorts them out, and like it just makes them even for some reason. And uh, you'll be thinking, wow, I'm deep meditating right now. This is how Gandhi did it. I know the secrets. I know the ways, you know. So, uh, go ahead and dig into your, your egg burger. <coughs> I actually can't eat this on camera. 